lots of the less privileged ones out there with no one to cater for them. But the good news is that there is an organization like Excel Charity Foundation to reignite hope. It was launched with a dinner in Lagos, garnished with a lot of entertainment. Enjoy it. The red carpet is laid at the rental hotel in Lekin to welcome guests as they walk through to witness the Excel Charity Foundation, which is about to be launched. Later, the exhibition of what the foundation is all about. After an hour of exhibition, the event started proper. It's the official launch of the Excel Charity Foundation, a foundation that is about igniting hope to the hopeless, restoring dignity and restoring the society. It's a humanitarian organization catering to the need of the less privileged in our society. There are various interventions are in line with the Millennium Development Goals and fall under four key pillars, health, education, well-being, and rehabilitation. Their purpose is to effect thoughtful uplifting of communities at international, national, and local levels. What we want to do now is to make sure that we get more partners to make greater impact even in our nation. We are hoping that through this Excel Foundation, God's name will be glorified through all the things that we are doing in Jesus' mighty name. We believe that it is not sufficient for us to be catalysts of change. Our theme for this year is to be the change. The organization started its charity work over a decade ago, and since then, lives have been touched with over 15 million people being fed, 500 million naira spent. 30,000 drug addicts rehabilitated, 92 students sponsored through the Education Fund, and the list goes on. With all the things they have done, they want to do more. This day is also an opportunity for them to raise funds for the foundation to carry out numerous projects it's already lined up. A call to act. And uh, I particularly like the driven by vision and uh, driven by passion. I, I think uh, for those of you who have worked on this project and uh, seen into this point, would like all of us that are here to give them a round of applause. Thank you. 